Breaking news, a shocking special election plays out in Alabama tonight. Democrat Doug Jones makes history, beating Republican Roy Moore for a seat in the U.S. Senate. CBS News called the race for Jones just minutes ago. And here are the latest numbers. With more than 98% of the precincts reporting, Jones with a lead of more than 10,000 votes. And this is the scene at Jones headquarters in Birmingham just minutes ago. He is the first Democrat from Alabama to win a seat in the U.S. Senate in the last quarter of a century. Mola Lange reports for WJZ with the very latest on this high-profile election. CBS News is projecting Democrat Doug Jones has defeated Republican Roy Moore in Alabama, winning the Senate seat once held by Attorney General Jeff Sessions. Jones's campaign rose to victory thanks in part to African American voters in the state. I think everybody realized how serious this election was once Donald Trump was on the bandwagon for Roy Moore. Moore, who traveled to the polls on horseback, stands accused of sexually harassing or assaulting multiple women when they were in their teens and he was in his 30s, claims he denies. I've just always thought that he was a good man, and I just don't pay attention to a lot of the talk. CBS News exit poll data showed voters were largely split on whether they believed the allegations were true. The Trump factor seemed to matter more to those who voted for Roy Moore than Doug Jones. Nearly six in ten of them said they made their choice to express support for President Trump. Roy Moore is the guy we need. The president stood firmly behind Moore, breaking with some members of his own party in an effort to keep the seat in the solid red state in Republican hands. You've had Republican senators who believe Roy Moore's accusers and who think the party, uh, by supporting Roy Moore and the president by supporting Roy Moore, uh, has gone too far, has put winning above all else. Moore had hoped to rally the conservative base in the state. His loss Tuesday night now gives Democrats a clearer path to a Senate majority in 2018. Mola Lenghi, CBS News, Montgomery, Alabama. And shortly after his win tonight, Doug Jones issued a tweet saying, Thank you, Alabama. He spoke with his supporters just minutes ago in Birmingham. I am truly overwhelmed. I am truly, truly overwhelmed. But you know, folks, and you have all heard me say this at one point or another in this campaign, I have always believed that the people of Alabama had more in common than to divide us. Again, Democrat Doug Jones winning the Senate seat in Alabama. We will have more on this win later tomorrow on WJZ.